What about Max Did You Love? Um, well, you know, in this first installment, I, I kind of loved, you know, it's, I've never had a, a situation or a scenario like this before. We're dealing with a sort of a franchise uh, sequel-esque movie. Mm -hmm. And um, he was mysterious. He, you know, I didn't know wh who he was. I didn't have any sort of prequel yeah. knowledge of who he was. I didn't know how he became Dauntless or if he was already Dauntless and didn't decide to choose Dauntless or if he was abnegation and became Dauntless. And then I definitely didn't know how he became the leader of the Dauntless. So um, it was just a lot of curiosity. And, and it was just a great script mm -hmm. and great cast and great director and great studio. So. I heard out. you have a little one that's really excited that you're on the project. Yes, yes. My 14-year-old <laughs> is extremely happy. I'm bringing him to the premiere. As you should. As I should. And Tori was one of my favorite <coughs> characters in the book. Oh. And it, she was because, first of all, she was the first person that Tris really trusted. Yeah. But she was also one of the most layered characters, which mm -hmm. I don't think you necessarily realize at first. So how much yeah. fun was taking her on? Um, you're right. It was fun. And, and, and I appreciate sort of that you know, the, the knowledge of the layering of her mm -hmm. and having that sort of background because it, it was a tricky sort of thing, you know, with Neil trying to find the balance between her resistance to Triss and not sort of playing it one note and just being cold to her and not, and just mm -hmm. thinking, oh, well, no, she's just complete bitch and she just doesn't want to help out. Um, the, 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 her resistance is, is rooted in something that's truly um, uh, painful for her. And because of that, um, you know, she's running for the hills when it comes to anything divergent, you know, starting in her periphery. So um, I I enjoyed the process. I enjoyed Neil's whole take on it. I enjoyed the take that I brought. And I, I found it interesting that you think you're going to bring what you bring to it, but really it's a, it is a collaboration between different visions. And, and, and weirdly, everybody is right in that space. But with Tori, I, I felt like the key was, um, the key to make her interesting was um, feeling from her um, what she wanted to say, but what wasn't coming out and that, that balance being right. So many different intricacies with people and, and everyone's kind of going after the same thing but they don't necessarily realize that. And mm -hmm. one of the things that I liked that you brought to Max that I didn't find in the book was you, you had that leadership that you brought everyone together. Mm -hmm. And it was almost like you questioned whether you were doing the right thing when it came to the kids coming mm -hmm. in and right. then when it came to the ultimate decision that you made. Well, you know, it was interesting. I'm, thanks for yeah, being observant nice. like that. But you know, the thing is, um, you know, because I knew so little about Max, um, I, I was constantly trying to find nuances to not just make him some stoic, sort of angry, leader. or leader, like, yeah. nah, you know, you know, that kind of thing. Um, so there are little things that I try to do, um, you know, that, you know, and I'm a very ex expression-based actor as well. So, like, when the camera's here, I, I like to let the eyes and what's going on tell some of the story, not just the words. And and that's what I that's what I tried to do. And I can't wait for the second installment. Yeah, because I can't wait to see what mm -hmm. ne is next. Neither can we as yeah. fans. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so Thank much. You Thank you so much. to have it on our screens. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.